Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. Today I'm over here at Regency, one of my new construction homes. It's gonna be closing next week, so we are doing the first walkthrough phase of it. And they still have a few lots left. And the cool thing is this next door neighbor came out and said, Angela O'Hare. Act like she knew me, but she saw, she's been watching my videos that I do a lot of here in Regency. So the floor plan that my clients bought is called the Stony Bridge. And this one has two bedrooms, a den, two baths, two car garage, and 1792 square feet. The cool feature about buying in this community is that the landscaping is maintained by the HOA, which is really nice. So you don't have to worry about trimming it um, or paying for landscapers to maintain it because it is maintained by the HOA. However, if a plant dies, that's your responsibility. So you need to ensure that the plants stay healthy. So this is an interesting model. I like how the garage is to the side and then you have this door in the middle with the turret-like feature and then the side gate is right there. Now, this is part of the Summit collection. They have a handful of lots left in the Summit. There are, what, a couple other collections in Regency. I've done a video on it. You can always watch it on my channel. I sell a lot here in Regency and um, I just love Toll Brothers. So as you walk in, just a standard garage, all this is gonna be gone by the time my homeowners move in. Um, this is your main water line. This is for your drip system and that's for the main water. And I also did a very detailed video um, with the gentleman, the builder, contractor or whatever that we walked through and described every aspect of this home that I will be posting on YouTube. So you can see how, um, Toll Brother homes are really built, especially here in Regency. And then you have a tankless water heater with um, a water softener line. So that's the garage. Let's walk in this door. It's the first time I ever saw the Stony Bridge model and they did a very good job. This home also was another spec home meaning that Toll Brothers had picked it out, picked the lot, picked all the finishings, the sales reps at Toll Brothers. And um, when it gets to the phase of drywall or when they start inserting the cabinets, then Toll Brothers will list this for sale. So it's a spec home or they call it a standing inventory home. But once they list it for sale, it still won't be ready for another two months. We close next week on this model and they did a phenomenal job of the options that they selected. They did the two-tone cabinets with the gray island and then the white quartz countertops with the white um, cabinets and then the gray, not sure what type, if this is quartz or he was saying a quartzite, just because of how raw it is, it's very uh, honed, that's what I was gonna say, with the beautiful gray herringbone backsplash and then they have all the bronze fixtures, which is throughout the entire house. You have your microwave, your double oven, convection oven, with a full-on farmer sink with the bronze fixtures, the KitchenAid appliance. You know what? There's no pantry. I guess they may have to build one. Just realize that. So you have your double sliders right over there. I think they're nine feet. They look like nine feet, which is cool because it opens in the middle right here. <sighs> I'm not going to worry about it. I have your honeybee thermostat. There's only one thermostat in here and it has a security system as well. Here's all your cabling for surround sound, internet, HDMI, all that jazz, all that stuff. And you know, when you do a walkthrough with the builder, you come in and you'll see all this blue tape everywhere. And you know, I'm gonna do another walkthrough next Monday to make sure that all this blue tape has been taken care of correctly. So right off of here is the den. Right here. And it's wired for a ceiling fan. That's a nice little office, it's perfect. Especially, you know, a 1,700 square foot house, it's still a good size house. Then the laundry room. The nice thing about this 
It also has the beautiful cabinets and the sink in the middle. Again, I've done a detailed video of this walkthrough. Uh, it's on my website, not my website, on my YouTube channel, or I will be posting it shortly, probably after this video. That way you can see exactly how these homes operate. The cool thing is this is like a dimmer and you can operate this with an app. Like the three windows, huge. Look at how tall the ceilings are in this model. And then the beautiful slider right there, 12 foot, I think. And then the primary bathroom with all the bronze finishings. Stay out the picture, the double vanity, huge long vanity with the same countertop as in the kitchen. Then you have your toilets and this beautiful shower with all bronze fixtures. They stacked our tile vertically and horizontally. And then look at this closet, OMG. Wow. You can put a, a baby room or no baby room. This is a retirement community <laughs> a bedroom back there. If I didn't mention Regency, Toll Brothers, Summerlin, 55 plus active adult retirement community. I kind of forgot what I was talking about in the beginning. All right, let's check out the secondary bedroom. Here's access from the garage. Here's the secondary bathroom. And actually what they did, really like what they did here in this shower. It's kind of cool. Isn't that beautiful? Got the herringbone pattern right there. Everything stacked vertically. I like that tile right there. That has the nice upgraded pedestal sink. And then you have like the drop zone area and then your secondary bedroom. And these ceilings are really tall. Now, the thing with this, I have to go out. Which way can I go out? If these sliders don't open, I'm gonna wanna go in the backyard. Bottom and doors, hard to open. Let's see if I can go out from the primary bedroom. I just want to show you how this backyard is set up. Adjust lock. Okay, perfect. So this is actually the side of the house. There's no real backyard on this Stony Bridge model. It's the side, but you have this beautiful long covered Lagosha with two um, ceiling fan plugs. And then there's a place to put your TV. So this is pretty much your yard. But you know, when you're living in a retirement community, you could probably fit a nice little pool or a spa, but who wants, I wouldn't want to have to maintain it. So this is really not much of a yard at all. <laughs> well, let's check it out. Now they do have common areas between all the houses. This is going to be maintained through the Summerlin HOA. My clients are, the buyers or owners don't have to maintain it right there. So this is technically would be the back of the house. We're just gonna go all the way around to the side. To, to surmise everything, this is the Stony Bridge over here, Regency at Summerlin by Toll Brothers, a 55 active adult community. This has two beds, a den, two baths, um, two car garage and 1719 square feet. And the starting price is 621.995. Um, yeah. That does not include lot premium, but the lot premiums here aren't as crazy as a lot of other communities in Summerlin. Here's your main electrical panel, your internet, Cox, and your gas. Um, then this is also for your pest control where they just sque squeeze in the liquid and it's done. So that wraps up my tour. Let me know if you're thinking about buying here in the Regency community. I'm well averse with selling in this community. You can give me a call at 702-370-5112 or post a link to a buyer form down in the description below. 
As always, thank you so much for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and all that jazz. And I'll see you guys on the next one.